Welcome back to Colorado and Company. The Rocky Mountain Siamese Rescue is based entirely out of foster homes. Siamese, at times, require a little bit more care than other breeds. And here to help us understand Siamese a little bit more is Jan Barch, an adoptable Siamese cat, Choco. Good to see you both. Hi. So Siamese, for the most part, very, very intriguing kind of cat. What does someone need to know before adopting this type of breed? They're very inquisitive. They tend to be talkative. Talkative. And um, they, they, they run the range from uh, as far as cat behavior right. goes. But, beautiful. But um, they don't show well in shelters, which is why we, we take them in. We have more of a, of a home-like environment. They're either in foster homes or our um, house in Superior is, is a house, so Aww. it has more home-like rooms. How sweet. And if somebody wants to adopt Chaco, tell me a little bit about her personality. She is very energetic and she's very spooked right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, There's a lot of cameras and lights yeah. and people around, yeah. <laughs> we had her playing really well last night, but she's also very affectionate and very cuddly and I had a few good purrs out of her. Oh, Here, you're so the, sweet. Look at the camera, sweetie. Oh, yeah, she's beautiful. <laughs> so the number to call is 970-351-6582 if you would like to adopt Chaco. Tell them you saw Chaco on Coco, 970-351-6582. How's your adoptive process actually designed to help make it easier and to also make sure that the cat is going to the appropriate home? We have an adoption process that... Um, starts with an application which is available online fill it out send it send the paperwork to the address mm -hmm. uh, don't fax it don't uh, email it right. but send it physically because we need the signatures and then we have people who call and screen ask more questions talk to the vets um, get some references you want to make sure it's a good home we do right. uh, we want to we want to avoid problems and returns and anything so far, we, we, we do a very good job good. of matching personalities to, to homes. Why do you like the Siamese breed so much? Oh, I don't know. I've always I've, I've had Siamese since I was a kid. So. Yeah. <laughs> She's just precious. If you're tuning in, Chaco is up for adoption. You can call 970-351-6582. And Siamese have what's called different color points. Yes. And, and do they all have blue eyes? Uh, yes, if, if they're totally Siamese. Well, if they're... Full. Mostly Siamese. Okay. Um, and a lot of blue eyed cats have Siamese in their backgrounds. Chaco is a lynx point, which means she's got lovely, lovely stripes. And top. I, um, the common one is seal point. Uh -huh. I think that's the thing, the one that, the color that most people identify as Siamese. But there are also blue and lilac points, which are very close together, but depend on the color of the, of the pads oh. on their paws. Chaco um, is beautiful, and those blue eyes are stunning. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me more about the cat house in Superior? Um, we've had the cat house for, oh, I don't know, eight or ten years now, and it's open three days a week, three afternoons a week, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. If, a, if we have a cat there that can be visited, it will say so on our website, on the cat's biography. Mm -hmm. And... Um, it's open to the public for the cats that are, that are live there. Is this something that she likes to play with? Well, I, she hasn't seen one of these, I don't think. But this uh. is something. These to these toys are ones we make, and include in adoption kits. We do. Oh, we have. We like a lot of homemade things. Oh yeah. So we have blankets um, for carriers so and. Cute. She's just like, yeah, Denise, I'm not so interested right now. Give me some catnip and maybe, but... She's, uh, she's just a little uncertain. <laughs> That's so cute. How many Siamese cats have you rescued over the years? Oh, we typically have about 40 uh, ad adoptions a year, which is quite good for a small rescue. And yeah. one year we had well over 100 because there were so many cats and kittens that came to us. She's just so mellow. What a mellow cat! <laughs> well, is she's it, actually pretty inquisitive and, and kind of a kind of a live wire. And oh it's just, my gosh. I think it's the setting here that's, that's so got funny. her spooked. That's so funny. Is it true that all Siamese cats are born white? No, um, that's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lie, producers. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they may be they may be lighter in color and darken as they um, get a little bit older, but they're not born white. How important is playtime with Siamese oh, cats? They love very. to play, right? They're high energy, and especially this one. Choco! Choco! <laughs> yeah, we're not. 
<laughs> We're not buying this today. Uh, Choco <laughs> is up for adoption. If you, oh, now she wants to play. You can let her roam on the couch. That's fine too. Well, thank you for I'm giving just us all, explore this all the info. The yeah. The, oh, that's great. Siamese are beautiful, smart, active, and of course, interesting. Their personality is awesome. Playing and lots of meows are what they'll bring to your household. Chaco would love to go home and be part of your family. Please visit this website, co.siamesrescue.org. You can also call 970-351-6582 for more info. That number again is 970-351-6582. Say, I want to adopt Chaco from Coco.